Good evening and welcome to Complain. My name is Heather Tapsell and welcome to Evening Prayer. I am continuing to use this little booklet published by the Church of England, Prayers for Use During the Coronavirus Outbreak. As we are waiting to hear from the Prime Minister next week as to what arrangements will be made for us to come out of lockdown or if lockdown will continue because of COVID-19. All the scriptures this evening are in this book. So we are going to look at Psalm 91 and we are also going to be looking at a very short reading from the first letter of Peter, chapter 5, verses 6 and 7. I am also going to use the collect for the first Sunday of Lent because tomorrow will be the first Sunday of Lent so even though we are not in church we have all had our weekly sheets sent out to us by email and the reading is there about Jesus fasting for 40 days in the wilderness. So shall we pray? The eternal God is your refuge and underneath are the everlasting arms. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and sleep may rest in peace. Our reading from Psalm 91. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High and abides under the shadow of the Almighty shall say to the Lord, my refuge and my stronghold, my God in whom I put my trust. For he shall deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He shall cover you with his wings and you shall be safe under his feathers his faithfulness shall be your shield and buckler. You shall not be afraid of any terror by night, nor of the arrows that fly by day, of the pestilence that stalks in darkness, nor of the sickness that destroys at noonday. Though a thousand fall at your side, and ten thousand at your right hand, yet it shall not come near you. Your eyes have only to behold, to see the reward of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your refuge and the Most High your stronghold. There shall no evil happen to you, neither shall any plague come near your tent. For he shall give his angels charge over you, to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you in their hands, lest you dash your foot against a stone. You shall tread upon the lion and adder, the young lion and the serpent, you shall trample underfoot. Because they had set their love upon me, therefore will I deliver them. I will lift them up, because they know my name. They will call upon me, and I will answer them. I am with them in trouble. I will deliver them and bring them to honour. With long life will I satisfy them and show them my salvation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. A reading from the first letter of Peter. Humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God, that he may exalt you in due time. Cast all your anxiety on him, because he cares for you. The prayer, the collect for the first Sunday of Lent. Let us pray. Almighty God, 
whose son Jesus Christ fasted 40 days in the wilderness and was tempted as we are, yet without sin. Give us grace to discipline ourselves in obedience to your spirit and, as you know our weakness, so may we know your power to save. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the silent hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this fleeting world may rest upon your eternal changelessness. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Shall we pray the prayer that Jesus taught his disciples, using whichever language and when whichever form ye prefer? Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come your will be done on earth as in heaven give us today our daily bread forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for the kingdom the power and the glory are yours now and forever amen In peace, we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly upon us and give us peace. Amen. Take care. Good night.